Yeah, we, we, we were actually expecting uh, a very offensive play from uh, Sandawan. And uh, the plan was to absorb the pressure and to see to it that in 15 minutes, early, 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 during the, 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 the start of the game, we should see to it that we don't concede, you know, and uh, they'll get frustrated if they don't uh, achieve the, you know, the, 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 what, you know, the goal that they, they would be needing to score early. So in, then in that instance, we should take advantage of uh, just scoring. Because yes, of I, I I can say they they enjoyed a lot of ball possession, you know, but they were not a threat as much as you know. If you look at the 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 the, the, the possession uh, percentage, you know, they had a lot of ball possession, but they were not a, th a real threat to us. So all we wanted was just to score a few goals to maintain our lead, and which we did very well. Yes, uh, Brown is, is injured, out injured, and uh, it was an opportunity for Camela to, to have a run, and which we believe that the 70 minutes that he had, he did well, he played uh, according to the instructions that we had given him. So we are very happy with his uh, performance. You know, it's, it's to us as Kick for Life, it's a milestone. The boys have written the history for this team because in the third year running in the Premier League, qualifying for a big tournament like competition like the, the, the top eight, it's, it's, a, it's a very good achievement. So we enjoyed the Saturday. But now the focus is gone for that game, for the top eight. Now the focus is in the Premier League. So the, 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 the celebrations and everything now are well gone, forgotten. So, but at the same time, we can take the good attributes out of, the, out of that game and uh, continue with the, 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 the Premier League fixture. Yeah, and obviously we, you know, I think we said it before. It's our first time um, in the top eight, and we wanted to see how well we can do in it. Um, obviously, over the last, uh, I mean, it's been a lot of history being written, isn't there, in the last, you know, the last few years now for this football club, and this is just another, as as coach said, another milestone reaching the semi-finals. Um, you know, I I was really hoping that it's something that we were going to achieve was was making it. It should be a really good weekend now. Um, you know, we're looking forward to, to going there and competing uh, again with the big boys like we've been trying to do and uh, and see how far we can go in that. And also the under-17s also qualified. Um, so they'll be part of the finals weekend as well. So it's going to be a great occasion for everyone. Um, yeah, we're really, really looking forward to it. We're looking forward to going to the finals. Yeah. But uh, it's going to be tough, huh? Semi, I mean, yeah, we're looking at the semi-finals first, obviously. Um, you know, it's, it's great to be part of that. Obviously... You know, every team wants to try and get to the final. We're all that's all that's going to be the target for all of us. But um, yeah, we'll, we'll we'll see how it goes in the semi-final. And yeah, of course, we'd love to get there if we can. But uh, you know, I think getting there in the first place is a great achievement, and really, again, reflects on uh, how far we've come over the last over like, the last couple of years. I think it, it's you know it's part of what we're all about as Kick for Life. Um, obviously, working with the youth, um, we wanted to do something to to mark the fact that we'd qualified and competing in this year's top eight competition and we thought the best way to do that was to uh, you know, to be able to bring some uh, underprivileged children who probably don't have an opportunity to, to come to games like this um, probably at all. So we thought it would be some, a nice thing to do and um, you know, hopefully they'll, be play, they'll come back for plenty more games and we've got some new supporters there. But it's, all, it's just all, all about what, you know, it's what Kick for Life is about, I think. So uh, it was a nice thing to be able to do. And, I think now we're going to look at the, you know, the semi, the finals weekend, and try and do the same thing for that as well if we can. No, the plan is just to continue uh, 
trying to do our level best. Uh, there is nothing out of this world that we like to, you know, but we'll appro we are approaching this match with all the respect to Diodi. They are a big team. They've achieved a lot. They've got quality players, mostly experienced national team material. They've got a good coach, you know, a big history behind the team, you know. So uh, we are looking forward to the game because this is the game whereby we are saying, let's go and weigh ourselves. Let's go and see now how best can we also you know, bring one of those good results that would make us all proud as, as, as Kick for Life. And we really uh, gonna give them, I think, a very good encounter. So, no, you know, it's, 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 we always say as, as, as a technical team of Kick for Life, like, let's, let's, we, we are building, we are in a, in a building phase and uh, we should try to do the best, you know, and uh, tread carefully, but always try to achieve maximum results. And the end result, we don't know, but all we need to do is just to be focused and uh, give respect to the opposition and be as competitive, as much competitive as we can. Yeah. Yeah, according to our medical team, they said, uh, there's, there's a big chance that he'll be fit, uh, he'll be fully fit for, for the weekend's match. I think we, we, we are, we've been in a process of managing uh, the pressure. We've been in a process whereby we always have discussions to maintain our high level of concentration and it has given us good results so far. So, like I said earlier, there isn't much special that we're going to do, but we just have to calm them, calm them down, you know, to be focused and enjoy the moment, you know. Yeah, and they should just enjoy the moment and have fun, but with, with, with uh, agency in terms of playing, you know, fully, fully focused. And I believe we, we have a team that would compete. Definitely this time around is going to be a different ball game altogether. Yeah. Yes, the morale in the camp it's high. You know, it's it's they, they are buzzing with confidence. They they are really enjoying themselves. So I think this game comes at the right time where, you know, they are just going with the flow. Positive flow. Not really. You know, it's always wise to continue with the winning combinations, winning team. Uh, so far, we have not, we don't see any major, but if Brown is fully fit, definitely he will be, you know, we will be happy to have him in the team. Oh, yes. No, they've been brilliant. Uh, they are now under, they, they are now having sort of, uh, telepathy in terms of the, 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 the way we want us to play, the way we want as kick for life. And uh, uh, Masuale and Muruti, the captain, together with Boga Mutwana, they have really formed a very formidable defense uh, department, you know. So the, our spine is quite strong and um, they are bringing a wealth of experience together into, into the team. And uh, with the likes of Tsidiso uh, Ramafikeng and uh, Lesweta, Marabedi, and Dali, they are really giving us a very good uh, options of offensive play, you know, and they've shown hunger, they've shown some maturity in their game. And uh, really we are, we are all satisfied as a technical team in terms of the way they have uh, progressed, you know, into uh, their performance. And uh, I think we're still gonna see good things in, uh, from them, you know.